Alrighty guys, what is up? We're here with yet again a new story time. As always, make sure you're leaving your lovely like on this lovely little video if you consider it that which is lovely. And let's go ahead and get into that which is this story time. Also, leave your story time ideas down below. But today we're going to be talking about past pets. And pets that I, maybe, looking back, regret ever getting. Ah! I hated this pet. I hated this pet. No, it's not Duchess. It's not Duchess. Duchess is an okay cat. Con compared to this being from hell, this was uh, nothing in comparison. Or Duchess has nothing on this uh, past pet. Uh, his name was Chip. His name was Chip. And he was what is known as a Siberian dwarf hamster. Sounds cool, right? Sounds really cool. Yeah, I thought the same thing. Until I realized he was Satan. So, uh, yeah. I had another one, and I don't remember the other one. That's why this one sticks out as harshly as it does. I was probably only in third grade when I had this little sucker. I can't remember the other one because there was two of them originally, two Siberian dwarf hamsters. But good old Chip killed him. <laughs> ah, yeah, he was a good, he was a good, love, fun, fun-loving family kind of guy. So, uh... Yeah, he killed my other Siberian dwarf hamster. It was recommended to us at the pet store that we buy two so he can have a companion, not someone to slay. So uh, he did slay the uh, other one. And when he did, uh, I knew that I was honestly just waiting until Chip died. Chip was, like I said, a Siberian dwarf hamster. I didn't know exactly what the lifespan of these little suckers were. But as far as I know, he died pretty early. Or, I don't know if he died early. I feel like I had him for a little over a year, and then he finally kicked the bucket. My brother also had a uh, guinea pig at this time as well. We all, we all loved that guinea pig. Uh, when that guinea pig died, we buried it. We had a little area. My brother even made a little cross to put on that which was the grave site. Uh, like I said, my brother was two years younger than me, so he was probably in first grade when his guinea pig passed away. And those were some good memories with uh, uh, what the... Uh, uh, guinea pig's name was Ginger, but Chip, oh, Chip, you little booger, you were just the devil, and I hated you, like, more than I ever should have, but I did hate you, and, uh, I, I, I bought all this wonderful stuff for him, he had this awesome hamster cage that was spacey, it had, like, a space kind of vibe to it, it had, like, this rocket ship on top that it could go up, and it could get into the, oh, I hated knowing that I wasted all that on just a jerk. Just a big old jerk. So yeah, killed my other pet. And he was just a mean person. He always bit me. And I didn't even have anything against him. I was trying to, like to fix whatever bond maybe I had broken. Maybe he lost his girlfriend when I got him from the pet store. I didn't know, but I was, you know, I was trying to let him know that, hey, I'm here for you. But no, he was just like, I'm Lord Satan 666. I was like, oh, okay. I'll just be over here watching TV. And it, it really stunk. So, my worst experience with uh, an animal that I've had is a Siberian dwarf hamster. If you ever go and you're considering buying one, just get one. Uh, because I feel like that pet owner kind of had us and saw us coming. And uh, I, I really regret waking up that morning and checking the cage to check on the two of them. And the other one is like bitten in half. Why? Why? Why would you do that? Like, why? Now, they got in fights and stuff like that. And I just thought, well, maybe this is normal. I've never had a hamster. <laughs> oh, well, I guess not. So, um, oh, and the one thing that we learned later was it was uh, male and male. You're supposed to get male and female. I don't want no baby devils. I don't know. I don't know. But, yeah, the moral of the story is if you're going to get an, uh, an animal, make sure you review it first. Um, just the word Siberian dwarf hamster. I guess it had a Napoleonic complex and it had to prove it to everyone that he was more superior. So, uh, yeah. Uh, moral of the story is review what animals you're going to buy first. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys are still enjoying these lovely little stories. As always, uh, leave your likes and story ideas down below. Uh, the server is coming along quite nicely. We will be here soonly finishing that which is prisons. That's the last thing we have to finish. And then the server will be up and running. I'm excited and I hope you guys are excited as well. As always, if you're excited for that which is the server, make sure you write down below. I'm so excited for the server to be ready. So yes, that lets me know that you also stayed for the entirety of the video. So yes, hope you guys enjoyed. Good day and well, as always, goodbye.